Did you know the aging process begins at around 30 years of age? Did you know there are things you can do to slow and even repair the declines of aging? Yes, that is what longevity studies indicate. And I wish I had access to the information I'm going to be sharing with you today when I was 30. But the good news is it's never too late to start living and looking younger, longer. Hi, I'm Bonnie Church, life and wellness coach and editor of All Things Ageless. Let's talk about healthy aging. You can see from my Vita, health and wellness is my passion. And you know, it's not just an academic pursuit for me. It's a personal passion. Like many of you, I've seen far too many people whom I love endure pain and suffering or die far too young from diet and lifestyle diseases. I want to do all I can to stay as healthy as I can for as long as I can. And I want to help others do the same. I am certified in nutritional consulting, but what that means is this. I'm not licensed to diagnose disease or prescribe medication. That is not the purpose of this presentation. What I do is collect information that is readily available to all, and I share my personal experiences. This presentation is intended to inspire your own investigation and to equip you with information that can help you carry on an intelligent conversation with your doctor about the things that matter to you. So in that spirit, let's get started. To understand how to support a healthy aging process, it helps to know a little bit about what the aging process looks like on a microscopic level. Did you know that you have little protective caps at the end of every chromosome in your body? They're called telomeres. They are sort of like the plastic caps at the end of a shoelace. Once gone, the shoelace frays. The cell becomes diseased and dies. Shortened telomeres have been linked to heart disease, strokes, diabetes, cancer, depression, dementia, osteoporosis, and wrinkling of the skin. Bottom line is your telomeres shorten, you age. Have you ever watched a five-year-old at play and lamented, wow, I wish I had that energy? What you are observing in that little bundle of activity is healthy, fully functioning mitochondria at work. Mitochondria, they are the energy producing engines lodged in every cell of your body. Mitochondria use the food you eat to produce ATP, your cellular fuel. You need this fuel for everything from blinking your eyes to thinking a thought. You need so much, in fact, that your body produces your weight in ATP every single day. Without ATP fuel, you grind to a halt. As we age, our engines can rust out, break down, and eventually die. The breakdown of these special engines means less energy is being produced. An energy deficit means fatigue, memory loss, and heart disease. Hormones. Think of your glands as the post office and your hormones as the mail. When hormones are not delivered, then your body breaks down. When serotonin is not delivered to the brain, you're depressed. When insulin is not sent out to shuttle sugar from your blood, you're diabetic. When human growth hormone is not pulsed by your pituitary gland, you are flabby, weak, and tired. As we age, the postal service begins to break down. The immune system. It's like the military that protects us from bacteria, viruses, toxins. As we age, the immune system weakens, making us more vulnerable to the diseases associated with aging. You can't stop these processes, but you can slow them down. Here's a good example. Identical twins, same genes, one smoked, one didn't. Can you guess which one? Here you visibly see the effects of an unhealthy lifestyle choice on the aging process. Smoking and other dietary and lifestyle sins speed up the aging process in several ways. Oxidation, you've seen oxidation. An apple cut and left on the counter will begin to rust pretty quickly. You've also seen antioxidation. If you squeeze lemon juice on the exposed flesh of that apple, it's not going to rust as quickly. Something happens similarly in your cells. When they're damaged in some way, they begin to rust, so to speak. Antioxidants can potentially slow or even prevent the oxidation of those cells. Glycation. Have you ever candied a ham? You just baste it with sugar and butter, pop it in the oven, and as it roasts, a sweet, crunchy glaze forms on the surface. This combination of sugar, fat, and heat not only coats the ham, it also coats your cells with a sticky, tar-like molecule called advanced glycation end products, also called appropriately ages. These sticky molecules are deadly. Glycation is triggered by high sugar, toxic or overheated fats, smoking, stress, and drugs, and they play a role in damaging every single organ in your body. One indicator that your level of cellular glycation is high is your A1C. Some of the harmful effects include normal supple body tissues become stiff and brittle, think wrinkles and damaged arteries, nerve function and sensitivity is impaired, 
think painful neuropathies. You get the sticky waste deposited through your cells and organs. Think cancer, diabetes, heart disease. Plaque builds up in the arteries. Think heart attacks and strokes. Neural pathways in the brain are clogged. Think dementia and Alzheimer's. Inflammation and tissue damage in the joints is triggered. Think arthritis. Bottom line, ages cause you to age faster. Inflammation. Not all inflammation is bad. The immune system will sometimes heat up to kill bacteria, but chronic inflammation is like a blowtorch on every cell in your body, causing damage and death. Radiation is like inflammation on the outside, and the main culprit is the sun. Chronic stress also kills. It's like battery acid on the brain. (laughs) It burns holes in your short-term memory. It keeps your belly fat. It overworks your heart. Stress can even affect how your genes express themselves in the direction of health or in the direction of disease. Wow, scary, huh? Well, now the good news. There's something you can do about these things. In the interest of full disclosure, I'm going to discuss products, supplements, and systems that I have distribution rights to. You know, it only makes sense to get products that I use daily at a discount. And I'm also using my investment in health systems and products to build something called a shopping annuity. In other words, I'm turning my purchases into income. If you want more information on that, then you can talk with the person who invited you to this presentation. Now let's talk about some ways to support the healthy aging process. I'm asked all the time if there was one healthy aging habit that I could cultivate that would not require me to dramatically change anything about my life, oh how we hate pain, what would it be? It would be to wear sunscreen. The sun is like a blowtorch on the skin. Note this example published in the New England Journal of Medicine of a truck driver who had the left side of his face continually exposed to the sun. Big difference, huh? My preferred product is called Cellular De-Aging Sunscreen. Why? It provides 50 SPF full spectrum protection and it contains an ingredient that protects telomeres. Remember the protective caps on your chromosomes? It's paraben free and contains skin rejuvenating antioxidants including vitamin E and green tea extract. It promotes skin firmness and elasticity. I keep one in my purse and one in my bathroom cabinet so I don't forget to put it on every single day. Now let's list some other things you can do to support the healthy aging process. And you can find more resources on each of these topics on the All Things Ageless website. First, some things to avoid. As I mentioned, avoid unprotected sun exposure. Don't use tobacco. Don't drink alcohol in excess. Avoid foods that are high in sugar and toxic fat and protect yourself from environmental toxins. But there's also some things you can do. Number one, of course, is eat well. What does that mean? Eat high quality food, real food, not the stuff that comes in a box from all food groups, carbohydrates, proteins, and fats in moderate amounts throughout the day. And don't forget to drink plenty of water. Our bodies are 70% water. Water plumps our skin, it helps us to get rid of toxin, and it stokes our metabolism. So try to get about eight to 10 cups of water a day. And cultivate serenity through deep breathing, prayer, meditation, And most importantly, through keeping things in perspective, there were some large studies conducted on people who lived to be 100 or more, and they identified four common traits. They were easygoing, optimistic, they loved to laugh, they were outgoing. In other words, they weren't stressed. Exercise, okay? You got to get out and move at least 20 to 30 minutes a day. Exercise builds bone mass and makes your heart more efficient and increases blood flow to the brain and it fights depression by helping the brain release serotonin. And also get a good night's sleep. Sleep deprivation reduces cognitive function and your memory and it causes your skin to age And studies show that regular sex can make you look at least seven years younger. And don't forget to sensibly supplement. There's no rocket science here, right? We all basically kind of know these fundamentals. Knowing and doing are two very different things. To live a healthier lifestyle sometimes means changing our behavior. And that's where the TLS Weight Loss Solution comes in. Yes, I know it's called the Weight Loss Solution, and you thought we were talking about aging, right? And maybe you're skinny as a rail. That can be a little confusing. And definitely if you're carrying excess fat on your body, TLS is spot on. But it's also spot on even if you're skinny as a rail. 
In my opinion, it's the ultimate anti-stress, anti-glycation, anti-inflammation, and anti-oxidation system. Here's a letter from a medical doctor I work with to help get his patients on track with their wellness goals. Improved body composition, improved blood glucose management, improved lipid profiles, reduced joint pain and inflammation, reduced blood pressure, increased energy and positive mental attitude, new lifestyle habits to help patients maintain their wellness. Sure sounds like healthy aging to me. One of the things I love about the TLS system is it's customizable. You can go online and you can complete a short survey to determine the best plan for you. Now let's talk about sensible supplementation. You know, when we talk supplements, we're talking science, and I'm not going to go into a lot of scientific detail here, but I do have a scientist friend, Dr. Nancy Miller Ely, who shall. You can find her videos on the All Things Ageless site. As you can see, Dr. Nancy has some creds. <laughs> She's brilliant. So if you want a little more backstory on supplementation, do have a listen to Dr. Nancy. Here's a little science here. Note the mice from the same litter. The one on the left has damaged vitamin D receptors. Note the difference in the rate of aging. Yes, getting adequate levels of nutrients is important. Even if we try to eat right, sensible supplementation can support our efforts. There are a lot of things that stand in the way of us getting the nutrients we need. Here's a list of a few. Modern farming techniques. We grow our food in demineralized soils. We pick it before it's ripe. We ship it cross country in gas-infused container trucks. Those foods will not have the nutrient density of locally grown organic food. And then it's how we process it. We strip all the nutrients out and then we replace them and we overcook it and we slather it in fat and sugar. And there's things like surgeries, gastric bypass, that one of the top surgeries now is reversing gastric bypass because of malabsorption issues. And then there's medications. Many medications affect our ability to absorb nutrients. Dr. Nancy Miller Ely talks more about that in her video. And then if you're over 60, you're going to have difficulty absorbing your nutrients due to less stomach acid and less gut flora. And then lack of sun exposure. You know, it's a double-edged sword. We don't want to fry our skin, but we also need the vitamin D, and you get the vitamin D from exposure to the sun. Oh, well. And then stress drains our vitamins, not only stress, but alcohol, coffee, sugar. <laughs> yeah, so we just might need to supplement to fill in those gaps. But here's a fact, not all supplements are alike. As suggested by the contrast between the dwelling on the left and the dwelling on the right, quality is everything. The supplements I personally use must meet the following standards. The raw ingredients need to be potent and toxin-free. What's on the label needs to be in the bottle, and it needs to be offered at effective amounts. And on top of that, it needs to be inspected by a third party to ensure that the above standards are upheld. That's why my go-to supplement is Isotonics. It meets those high standards and it's bioavailable. Unlike the sad vitamin tablet on the left, Isotonics is a powder you can mix with water. When it's taken on an empty stomach, it offers you the nutrients in a high concentration and in a form that your body can absorb within a few minutes. I like to say it's the closest thing to getting your vitamins through an IV. And what I really love about Isotonics is this. I love juicing, but juicing is expensive. If I buy three high quality juices a day, it's gonna cost me roughly 18 to $24 a day. Also, if the juice is not cold pressed, many of the nutrients can be destroyed by the high heat of the juicing process. And when you remove the fiber from fruits and veggies, it can create undesirable sugar spikes. If I make my own juice with organic fruits and veggies, it's almost as, a, as expensive, and it costs me almost as much as buying it. It's very time consuming, and it's very messy. That's why I love my isotonics. I call it my magic elixir. I get the nutrient density I want without having to go through the expense, mess, time involvement of juicing. And my isotonics are offered with appropriate amounts of sugar so they can be used by my body efficiently. You know, I can get an appropriate concentration of the basic nutrients really easily. It's customizable. I can choose what I want in my elixir. Basically, I can get a full spectrum compound for under $2 a day. So compare 18 to $24 a day, $2 a day. I will share with you what I consider my basic ageless elixir kit, also known as the daily essentials. I take a multivitamin in isotonic form. 
A high quality multivitamin fills the nutritional gaps in your diet and a study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition indicated that women who consume a daily multivitamin have longer telomeres than those who don't. I also take a product called OPC3 with pycnogenol. I call it my fire extinguisher because it's amazing at reducing inflammation in your body. If I were told I could only take one product, I think this would be the one. Because it's a powerful antioxidant, we talked about oxidation, it's a powerful anti-inflammatory, it's a powerful glycation resistor, it promotes heart health, joint health, it also helps in a very personal area. We talked about a healthy sex life, well there's this guy called Dr. Stephen Lamb, he's the author of a book called The Hardness Factor, and he's sort of like the Dr. Oz for the talk show called The View. He believes in OPC3 as a complementary protocol for erectile dysfunction and general heart health. So there you go. And I also take a B-complex in a form that my body can absorb. Without going into a lot of detail, some of you are taking B vitamins that your body can't even utilize. Yeah, there are B vitamins and antioxidants in the multivitamin, but sometimes we need more. Why? Because there are so many things that drain our B vitamins, coffee, stress, alcohol, medications, and you don't want to be without your Bs. Deficiencies lead to things like shrinking brain, okay, that affects your memory, obviously, exhausted adrenals, you're going to feel tired, elevated stress hormones, you're going to be moody, and silent inflammation in the heart and in the joints. Your skin will age if you don't have adequate levels of B-complex. There you go. Take your Bs. And even though there's some calcium in my multivitamin, I take a little bit more, but I take calcium with magnesium and D3. Studies reveal when calcium levels are low, it's gonna trigger your bones to release calcium into your bloodstream, so it's gonna weaken your bones. Your body's gonna store fat and hold on to it stubbornly, even if you're on a low calorie diet. You're gonna have constricted arteries, which means elevated blood pressure and an increased risk of colon cancer. But calcium needs some cofactors in order to be absorbed, specifically magnesium. Many people are deficient in magnesium. And it can produce symptoms of anxiety and depression. It can also cause problems like muscle weakness, eye twitches, fatigue, insomnia, poor memory, confusion, nervousness, rapid pulse. And serotonin, the feel-good brain chemical, it depends on magnesium for its production and functions. So I'm happy to get a little extra magnesium in my supplement. And then also, this supplement contains extra vitamin D3. Here is a great quote by Dr. Michael Holick in his book, The Vitamin D Solution. He says, vitamin D deficiency is a global pandemic that has serious health consequences that many chronic diseases, including cardiovascular disease, autoimmune diseases, type two diabetes, many deadly cancers, as well as infectious diseases, including upper respiratory tract infections, influenza and tuberculosis, could be reduced when vitamin D status is improved. All good reasons to take calcium plus. So there's my basic ageless elixir kit, also known as the daily essentials. And what I love about it is you can compound each of these supplements into one potent juice at whatever level you and your doctors deem necessary. Or you can purchase these products separately and, and use them separately. Because they're an isotonic powder, you can enhance your daily regimen with other isotonic products. And there's several to choose from, but I'm gonna share with you one of my favorites. My all-time isotonic add-on is resveratrol, and I drink a daily toddy of this stuff, and it costs me about as much as one-third of a cup of Starbucks. Note here the article from the Huffington Post touting it as the magic bullet of anti-aging. I have that article posted on the All Things Ageless site, so you can read that, but let me sum up a few things for you. Uh, resveratrol is an age-defying powerhouse. It contains ingredients that promote the normal activity of the CERT1 gene, or the longevity gene. It helps to kill unhealthy cells in your body as it promotes the development of healthy cells. It supports heart and artery health. It also helps to stimulate the activity of mitochondria so it can help you to maintain your weight as well. Not all resveratrols are alike. It takes a lot of resveratrol in order to get an efficacious dose. For instance, you'd have to drink three bottles of red wine. And let's face it, if you drank three bottles of red wine, you will not be driving that day. Or you'd have to eat hundreds of grapes. 
types and you would not be driving for very different reasons, okay? So what makes this resveratrol so special is it contains an ingredient called resveravine and resveravine is just incredibly potent and it's offered to you in an isotonic. You can add the resveratrol to an existing toddy or you can drink it on its own. Another daily supplement that I take that Dr. Nancy talks about in greater detail is an omega-3 fatty acid, specifically heart health omega-3. I love it because it's high quality and not all fish oils are, so let the buyer beware. But among the growing list of benefits of fish oil, you can now add something akin to a youth elixir. Not only do the fatty acids in fish oil protect your telomeres, but research suggests they actually help them to grow, essentially reversing the aging process, I guess. That's what you would call it. Anyway, definitely omega-3 is something you need to think about. So there you have it. Remember, always check with your doctor before making diet and lifestyle changes. And also check with the person who invited you to this presentation for information on how you can turn your investment in wellness into income through the shopping annuity.